This is Pal. He's the friendly sort of giant robot. This 20-foot tall machine helps make flight possible. You know when you're on an aeroplane and you look out of the window and you think to yourself, all that's keeping me in the air here is some clever aerodynamics over that equally clever wing? Well, if you're on a 737, this is where those wings are made. Wings end up beautifully complex, but they start very simply. They're hollow. They're like a piece of corrugated cardboard or maybe a wall in your house. There's a top and bottom sheet and then ribs or struts between them. The void in the middle is actually the fuel tank, so everything has to be joined together perfectly. What this line does is it, it builds up our upper and lower wing panels that build up our wing box on our 737 wing. At the rates we're at right now, we install 44,000 fasteners a day. Well, we're building 42 airplanes a month right now, so two sets of right and left hands every single day. And that is where good old PAL comes in. The panel assembly line is a robotic update to the age-old process of clamping, drilling, and then riveting wings together by hand. And our legacy line has been around since the 1960s. And the new assembly line, uh, we have about 90% of the fasteners are installed by the machine. It's a lot easier on the workers now. They don't have to practice their yoga to reach the furthest corners or risk repetitive strain injuries. Nine PAL machines in total will allow Boeing to build wings in a continuous flow, twice as fast as it used to. Lasers guide the machine for maximum precision when joining wing panels together with fasteners. It can follow the panel's curvature. But it's the scale here that's really impressive. When you're building a 737 with a total wingspan of over 100 feet, it really helps to have some pretty big friends on your side.